Hey everyone, this is Ben with RegisteredNurseRN.com and in this video I'm going to talk about X-ray techs, also known as radiologic technologists. And I'm going to do a quick job overview, the education requirements, and then I'm going to talk to you about the salary information for this profession. So what does an X-ray tech actually do? Well, they take X-rays, right? And they also do a lot of other job duties, including adjusting and maintaining imaging equipment. They will work with physicians to determine which parts of the body need to be x-rayed or have those imaging scans. They will prepare patients for procedures by getting their medical histories and asking them various questions. They will also uh, help the patient get set up and put that protective clothing on them or that lead vest or lead cloth on them to help protect their other tissues from the x-ray. They will operate the computerized equipment, they will keep detailed patient records, and they will also get together those mixtures that you'll have to drink sometimes to help those imaging scanners get into the soft tissue areas to develop a better imaging scan. So that's a little bit about what a radiological technologist does on the job. What about the education requirements? Well, generally speaking, it does vary from state to state. You can usually do it, depending on your state, through a graduate certificate program through an associate's degree program or a bachelor's degree program and i would really recommend you look up the requirements for your particular state because it does vary most commonly it's done through an associate's degree program and you do that and then once you do that most states if not all states are going to require you to become licensed and you usually do that by completing the state exam and the american registry of radiological technologists uh, puts out an exam as well and sometimes the states will use that or sometimes you'll take that. And you can also get MRI certification and a lot of x-ray techs will also become certified or get the necessary credentials so they can also do the MRIs. And the ARRT also provides that certification as well. So that may be something you want to look into if you're interested in becoming an x-ray tech. Okay, so that's a little bit about the job overview and the education requirements. Now let's talk about salary information. How much money does an x-ray tech actually make on average? Well, all these numbers that I'm getting ready to tell you about come from the Bureau of Labor Statistics. That is the government organization that collects and records jobs data. And all this is accurate as of 2014. And the average hourly wage for a radiological technologist in the United States was $27.65. And the average salary was $57,510. Now that's just average. Some people make more, some people make less, depending on the industry in which you work, the state in which you live, and the number of years of experience, and so forth. So it does vary. Those are just averages. The good news is that the Bureau of Labor Statistics predicted a 21% growth rate between years 2012 and 2022. So there does appear to be some room for growth and some jobs that may open up over the next uh, between that decade time frame, which is good news, right? Now, let's talk about the industry with the highest employment levels. What industry out there had the highest employment levels for the x-ray tech? Well, general medical and surgical hospitals came in at number one. The average salary there was $58,610. Offices of physicians came in at number two, $53,610. And then medical and diagnostic laboratories came in at number three, $58,030 was the average salary there. What industries paid the most money, though? Well, the top paying industry was commercial and industrial machinery and equipment rental and leasing, believe it or not. And the average there was $72,500. I guess these x-ray techs went and worked for a company that developed the machinery, maybe. Second, colleges and universities came in at number two, $65,920. And then nursing care facilities came in at number three, the average salary, $64,750. Now let's talk about the states. What were the top paying states for this profession? California came in at number one, average there $73,550. The District of Columbia came in at number two at $72,530. And then Massachusetts came in at number three, $70,010 was the average there. Now let's talk about the lowest paying states. West Virginia came in at number one, $45,880 was the average there. Alabama came in at number two, $45,930. And then South Dakota, number three, $46,280.
And I should be putting a link to our website in the description below this video within a day or so. And it will take you to a page where we have all 50 states and it has our averages and hourly wages and all that. So if you're interested in that, you may want to check that out. So that's a little bit about the X-ray tech or the radiological technologist. I hope this video helps you. Thank you so much for watching and please consider subscribing to our YouTube channel.